feel like I say this all the time, but this look is super simple. Like, I feel like for some, especially beginners, it may look complex, but it's actually pretty easy. And I'm also introducing some, like, new goodies today. Some new products. Um, mainly it's the P. Louise bases. I finally got them in the mail. I got these plus the colored ones, but I'll be using these today in rumor number four and rumor number zero. Or rumor, rumor zero. So to start, I'm just going to prime with rumor base number four. So with this base, you're not supposed to set it. So I'm just going to go right in with my shadow and I'm going to be using the Zulu palette by Juvia's Place. And I'm going in the two shades I'll be using for this look is this pink right here and this uh, metallic shade right here. I'm just going to start with that matte pink shade and I'm just going to apply that all over my eye. Alright, now that that's done, um, I'm going to start making the shape for the, um, crown and the easiest way i found to do this because i also did this look like last year i never posted it but like i attended this look last year and it was a struggle and the easiest way i found is to go into like a white if you have a white like pencil liner or something like that that'll be easier to just draw it on but the one that i have i don't like so i'm just gonna go in with rumor um zero base from p louise and i'm going to add dots kind of on the um where my crease is, I'm just going to add five dots. So I'm going to put, I know that <clears throat> the point of the crown, like, I want it to be, not the point, but like the middle point of the crown, I know I want it to be about right here. So I'm going to make that, um, I'm going to make that dot first, and then the other dots follow, rather than, st rather than starting from the inside and going out, it's easy to just start in the middle because that's like supposed to be your highest point it probably doesn't look like that on this eye but yeah so now i'm gonna do the same thing um kind of you want to tilt your head back too to make sure that you're getting it at a good angle so you go in Now you have your basic outline, start filling it in. Start filling it in. So now I'm gonna go in with that metallic shade. Now I'm going to go in with the ColourPop Jelly Munch Shadow in the shade Wavelength. And I'm just going to apply it over top. Now, when you open this, it looks like this. So it looks white or iridescent. Um, and then when you smooth it out, you get kind of that like pink undertone. So now it's time for what I feel like is the hardest part, and that's applying the jewels. I got mine from eBay. I'll leave a link down below, but you can get them at like Michael's, Joann's, any craft store. And the way I'm going to apply it is that I'm going to put the biggest one, of like, not the biggest one of my collection, but the biggest one on my eyes is going to be the one in the middle. Then the second biggest one are going to be the one right here and right here. Those are going to be the same size, and then the smallest ones are going to be the ones on um the outside of the crown yeah take some lash glue put it on the back of my hand and i'm going to take a dotting tool and i'm just going to i actually should have just used this for the um making the dots in the first place wow anyway i'm gonna take the biggest one and tilt my head back
Oh, now that the hardest part is done, I'm just gonna go in and prep for lashes. And of course, I'm going in with I'm going in with the D22 lashes by Viso Free Lashes. Okay, now it's time for the face. I'm just going in with the usual um, NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop foundation in a cappuccino. Going in with C12. Ooh, I look crazy. Um, as per usual, I'm going in with the e.l.f. Uh, bronzer in Turks and Caicos, and I'm mixing both sides to bronze my face up. Now I'm just going to dust away the powder. I'm gonna spray my face with the Mario Badescu Aloe Cucumber and Green Tea Facial Spray. And I'm going in with the Beard Cosmetics Illuminate um, Cream Chicken Lip Tint and Peaches and Cream. Um, I don't know, I feel like this is a very, like a baby girl esque look. Like, this is giving me like cute vibes um so i want my cheeks to not be like pink but I, I want some like like a bright color out of my cheeks so it's this orange shade um and then for uh, highlight i'm going to be using the makeup revolution um Illuminator drops in bronze gold. Now that that's all done, I'm gonna go with my I'm gonna go to my lower lash line, and I'm gonna take the pink that we used earlier, that matte pink, and just apply that to my lower lash line. For lips, I'm using Fenty Beauty Kilowatt Lipstick in Uncuffed. And you could just leave it like this if you want. I do like it like this, um, but I think it's, I want it to be like really, really fun and flirty and cute. So I'm just going to go over it with um, Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm. I actually don't know the name of this lip gloss, but the first lip gloss that they came out with. Um, yeah, so this is actually a nice combo. I like this, this lip. Hmm. The lip gloss tastes really good.